Okay, so my son had a nightmare and then the video got more screwed up than it already is. So this is, I guess this is part two. So yeah, this is the, um, the pumpkin mask that I'm gonna do. Um, last week, I, no, a couple of weeks ago, I tried to do a mask. I did a do-it-yourself face mask and it did not go very well. I didn't like it at all. It had cooked oatmeal, honey, oil, and like an egg. And it just, it, it just didn't, but I hated the texture of it. And it just kind of dried on my face and all hard. I just didn't like it at all. So yeah, if you're wanting to do do-it-yourself mask, there's so many different types, or you can just come up with your own. So I'm doing this pumpkin one, and I hopefully, hopefully it will work good. Hopefully it doesn't leave my face stained yellow. So this smells really good. It's a perfect like fall mask. Okay, so I'm gonna leave this face mask on for probably 30 minutes. Wash it off with warm water. And then I will put some oil on my skin and do the gua sha facial massage treatment. Um, I really want to start doing facial massage every single night if I can as much as as much as I can because I feel like it'll really it, I hope that it'll help me with my um, like my smile lines I feel like the leaner I get at my age that the more aged appearance I have and it's unfortunate but it's just the way that my face is shaped and my genetics. I don't know, maybe it's because I don't have the best sleep, sleeping, hygiene, or I don't know what it is. But yeah, I'm aging. They say that black don't crack, but I don't know if that's true. It's not true in every case because I have cracked. It is what it is. Okay, so facial massage, that. And then I think to, tonight I am going to do some teeth whitening. Because after getting my braces off, I've noticed that like two of my teeth on the top are kind of like darker, a little bit darker than the rest of my teeth. Probably because I wasn't able to get to it really well, you know, with the brackets in the way just the way the bracket sat on my teeth. So for do-it-yourself at-home teeth whitening, I am using this mixture of one teaspoon baking soda and a half a teaspoon of hydrogen peroxide. Two things that many, many, many people have in their houses already because they both have lots of uses for home. So I'm gonna, brush my teeth with it, it kind of makes, when you mix it together, it makes a little paste. So I'm going to brush my teeth with it and then let it sit on my teeth for a couple minutes and then rinse it out. Rinse it off. And I think that's it for my spa night. I'm gonna watch X-Files. That's part of my spa night because I love X-Files. I don't care what anybody has to say about that. I love X-Files. It's, it's an awesome TV show. Awesome. So yeah, that's pretty much it. You know, I am a big advocate for people pampering themselves, self-love, you know. Yeah. So, you know, anyone watching this, you should try to pamper yourself. Do what i done. Maybe try a pumpkin mask, you know, try some teeth whitening, facial massage, whatever, you know. Just love yourself. All right. Bye.